Apparently over for a teenager missing in four months in Phelps County. Good evening from KY3 News. I'm Steve Grant. I'm Lisa Rose. 13-year-old Jonathan Shea walked away from his grandma's house in the St. James area last summer. Human remains turned up in that area this weekend. KY3's Dustin Hodges has details from the Sheriff's Office in Phelps County. Lisa, on Sunday, someone called the Phelps County Sheriff's Office and said they had found human remains near the Dry Fork Creek near St. James. Sheriff's deputies went out to that spot yesterday. They also went out there again today, and they found more remains scattered around that same area, as well as articles of clothing that Jonathan Shea's mother says belonged to the 13-year-old boy. Sheriff Rick Lesenby says it is likely the December flooding that made the remains visible. On July 9th of 2015, Shea and his 11-year-old cousin disappeared from Shea's home near St. James to go play near the Dry Fork Creek, but only Shea's cousin returned. A massive search with volunteers and law enforcement searching on foot by boat, by air, and using ATVs began for Shea as so soon after his disappearance that involved dozens of volunteers and lasted for several weeks. People don't have any idea how many man hours was out there and how many flights were done out there, how many night flights was done out there, how many infrared cameras were put out there. Uh, you know, there's there, the manpower is unbelievable. There's relief, but... Again, it's like your whole heart and your world, you're missing a piece of them because you were hoping that you would be the one to go find him and bring him home, and you can't. Sheriff Lizenby says Shay's disappearance does not appear to be suspicious, but the investigation is not yet complete. Those remains will be sent to a dentist's office in Columbia to be identified. Live in Rolla, Dustin Hodges, KY3 News. Firefighter.